He's best known as the police officer who announced this news to the world. It's my privilege to announce that in the early hours of this morning, the Western Australian Police Force rescued Cleo Smith. Now, Cole Blanche says he's ready to take on the role as the state's top cop. The most important thing for me moving forward as the next police commissioner is to serve our community, to serve our state and to serve it with duty. Witnessing uh, Cole Blanche assume this role uh, is a, and a tremendous pleasure and very reassuring because he represents continuity, certainty. He'll succeed Chris Dawson, who will be sworn in as the state's 34th governor next month. After eight years working together, the current commissioner had nothing but praise for his successor. I obviously watched him very closely uh, and I have full confidence uh, in Cole's integrity. Uh, and lastly, he cares. And it's not just care about our people, uh, the men and women of our police force, he cares about our community. The police union says Cole Blanche comes into the role at a time where morale within the force is at an all-time low, saying officers are feeling overworked and undervalued, problems it's urging the new commissioner to tackle. And the new appointee says he's determined to continue approving police relations with Indigenous communities. I meet with them regularly and that's something I'm absolutely focused on to continue the mantle from Commissioner Dawson's apology in 2018 about our relationship with the Aboriginal community and continue that focus of making sure we're doing it in the way that's going to work for a community. The process of finding his replacement as Deputy Commissioner will begin soon. Tabarakal Giroud, ABC News.